Hell yeah. Is this the one that Josh was singing on? I believe so. I got HPV now. That sucks. <laughs> Damn, dude. All right. No, what, uh, one time for Kaylee for doing this roast. That's why I love Kaylee so much. I love it. That's why I'm doing it. Even though she is dressed like sh her sex playlist is the Harry Potter soundtrack, which I think it's... So she, did you know, when she was a kid, fun fact, she was actually in Harry Potter. She had a small part. Yeah, they modeled her body and then they made Dobby the Elf, which is pretty cool. <laughs> Okay, okay. Uh, <laughs> Chris, to me, Chris is like the human version of a genital wart, okay? <laughs> because drunk sex seems good until you get a good look at him. It's not worth the lifelong regret. Oh, yeah, you can't get rid of me. Um, yes, Kaylee is great. Uh, she does look like a queer girl that got bullied so hard by the swing choir she's straight now, though, which... <laughs> not far off. I've never seen that before. <laughs> A uh, little known fact about Chris, he's a member of an aging pop punk band. It's called Panic at the Prostate Exam. <laughs> Kaylee, you pin insects to cork boards and call them your precious, okay? You fucking <laughs> Everyone needs old a hobby, young bitch. <laughs> I'm sorry, you go. Uh, was that the roast? That was it, and it didn't do that well. Oh. But I thought it was, was a rebuttal. That was the full, that was the full <laughs> joke, unfortunately. Chris is 5'7". Uh, he's so short when his girlfriend wants to peg him, she has to measure him to make sure he's tall enough to ride. <laughs> yeah, don't, honestly, I've been, that last joke bomb because it was too mean. Don't listen to me, I'm too mean. I'm just jealous because Kaylee has a better mustache and penis than I do, so. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Um, yeah, no, Kaylee, oh, this one's stupid. This one's gonna be so bad. But Kaylee looks like a cat lady, but her cat doesn't like her. Um, <laughs> so do you, dude. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit. A little scratchy. <laughs> Chris looks like his mom breastfed him with monster energy drink. <laughs> yeah! That's it. That was it? That was it. Damn, that was good, though. Because that's, <laughs> that's true. That's not even a joke. You fucking, how'd you find that out? You, uh, Kaylee looks like, uh, she looks like a Karen that screams at black people and like a a white girl on college that screams for black people, but dresses like a girl that's never met black people. <laughs> that was good, that was all right. Uh, Chris looks like he was conceived in a hot topic and will die in a dumpster behind a Wendy's. Burger King, bitch, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> I was trying uh, to give you a little credit. Shut up, dude. Kaylee's such a hack, she stole my eyebrows, okay? Uh, <laughs> Kaylee's, uh, Kaylee's eyebrows are so wild, they look like they're warning you about her bush. <laughs> it's a landing strip, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Chris, Chris feels like the type of guy who would get into magic to impress girls and then stick with it because he wants to scare black people. <laughs> black, black people like magic, though. <laughs> Way more than the whites. But I've never met any, so... <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that rocked. I'll introduce you, you'll run away, but... Um, and this is this is true. Uh, Kaylee is a teacher for children with disabilities, like mental disabilities. Oh shit! You're gonna hate the second half of this so much. Okay, yeah, she's a teacher, which I can only imagine is like a scared straight program where, where like the adults just point at Kaylee and go, "Look how bad it can get." Take your fucking meds. Uh, <laughs> Chris reminds me of a young Johnny Depp and that I do believe he will be accused of domestic abuse soon. <laughs> I call him Captain Hack Sparrow. <laughs> That's it. Give it up for him. That's a battle right there. Give it up for him. Woo! Woo! Oh my God. Oh my God. Let's go to our panel once again. Let's start. Josh Adam Myers. Look at that good, that good girl you got with you there. Yeah, you want you want to click that one on? You want to click that one on? Here we go. Here we go. Check. Yeah, y'all hear me? Yeah. This is lack of dogs, so and nobody do any sharp moves, or she will bite your face off. She hates Mexicans too, so don't be worried. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You're El Salvadorian. Um, 
So, first of all, I want to give you both a shout out for making both of you having great jokes, but both keeping a very likable spirit throughout the whole thing. So I think they deserve the fucking kudos because that was such a fun way to start it off. Both of you had great jokes. Um, and I don't know if everybody liked you because both of you look like you're in different places in your transition. <laughs> You with, with, with your patchy beard and her man-like body. <laughs> but you had, you had three really great jokes topped off by the number one joke, which was of the whole battle, which was the three different stages ending with her dress. So I'm giving it to you. It was really great. All yeah. right, one for Chris Grieco, one for Chris Grieco. Let's go down to Aaron Weber. Aaron Weber, how are you? How are you, Aaron? Right, good to see you. Is Grieco your yeah. real name? Yeah. Doesn't that sound like a slur? <laughs> For I was like, I was aghast that he called you that when you walked out. I was like, Chicago's different. Uh, <laughs> at least say it under your breath, you know. We don't, we don't, we are southern gentlemen up yeah. here. <laughs> I like both of y'all a lot, Kaylee. Monster Energy Drink was very funny, but I gotta tell you, Greco, something about me you don't know. I'm a massive Harry Potter fan. Mm. And you dropped a couple references in there, and you mentioned the soundtrack, which is nominated for a ton of Oscars, by the way. Uh, John Williams has more Oscars than any human being on Earth, so check it out. My vote is for Greco, everybody. All right, Thank we got you. two for Chris, two for Chris. Tori Kilkenny, how are you? Um, I, I've got to give it up for you beautiful young boys, and maybe someday, hey, maybe someday we come back in a couple years and you'll be strapping young men. Um, but I, I think it was a very tight battle, but I will say, and Kaylee, this is probably the only time you'll hear this, you kept it very tight. <laughs> I get it. That's now I get time, it. Yeah. I get so it. So I'm going to give it to Kaylee. All right. We got two for Chris, one for Kaylee. Evan Hall, where are we? Uh, this was fun. I felt like I was watching couples counseling for a polyamorous couple. That was good. <laughs> uh, I'm giving this one to Chris. All right. Chris gets it. Give it up for Kaylee Horton as well. Oh, my God. Absolutely fantastic. Hey, thanks for watching Roast Battle Chicago. If you guys want to subscribe to our channel, you get even more content, a bunch of it, hours of it for free. And you can hit that little like button down there, hit the subscribe right over here, and check out these videos right over here.